Hello. Hello, everyone. Hello, hello. I'm not, I'm not sure if we're up to date yet on this. So, uh, am I live? I should be live. Uh, hello, everyone. Welcome back to Cattle and Crops. I know I said I was pretty upset about this and blah, 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 blah. But we're going to give this another shot, guys, because I really I really can't make... I can't, I can't be one of those people that I complain about and then do it myself. So, I don't want to pass judgment on this. Um, without without making a proper uh, a proper attempt at seeing how far we can go with this and seeing more of the game and stuff, so uh, I feel really stupid and I feel really sad about the way that I approached this in the last video. So I really wanted to come back and give it one more shot just to see. Uh, as you guys see down the bottom right hand corner, there has been a new uh, a new logo added to our slideshow. Um, and if you look in the description below the video, we are now partnered with Nitrato. Now, what that means is I have access to, it's a, it's a small server, but I have access to a, an eight slot farming simulator server. So, uh, Bob, we're going to get our multiplayer server. Uh, thanks to the partnership from Nitrato. Uh, big thanks to them for helping us out. If any of you guys know of anybody wanting a server, send them over here. Tell them to click that affiliate link and uh, and help us out a little bit. That would be fantastic. Now, uh, or an ARC server or anything else. They offer many different types of servers. So send them, send them over, tell them to click the link, and uh, I'll get some commands and stuff set up for it later. Uh, for now, the link is all I have set up. I'm going to get some commands set up for chat. That way we can uh, we can do that kind of stuff. All right, Dom, sounds good, man. I appreciate you coming by and, and uh, letting us know. Anyway, uh, Bob, Corain, Tanya, how are you guys today? I hope everybody's doing well. Let's get right. Let's get back into this. I want to get back into this and see what's... Uh, I think we were on this one. So uh, I just want to load whatever profile we were on here. Hopefully it doesn't start me over. If it does, I'm going to be upset. <laughs> I mean, I'm going to be real upset. Like, I'm probably just going to quit and we'll go play something else. That's it. Also, I have no sound. I don't know if the, the music's supposed to be playing or what, but I have no idea. Loading map. Forever loading map, I guess. Well... I don't I don't know what's going on, guys. Uh, how did, how was everybody's yesterday? Sorry I didn't stream, guys. I, I woke up late and I just really oh this field is nasty. Oh, that's right, we're planting corn, aren't we? Yeah, we're we're planting corn. All right, let's uh let's see. How do I turn the implement on again? Oh, that's not the button I wanted. Let me back out of that. Um, key bindings. That's what it is. Thought that was a horse and buggy over there. Uh, let's see. Shift gear up, shift gear down, toggle gear. I think I use control to go over here and look. We want to turn stuff on and off. So enable, disable, raise, and lower. All those are the same. Okay, that's right. All right, so let's get rid of that. And let's lower this puppy down. And it is muddy as all get out. Uh, I think it's on. It is on. Man, it is muddy in this field. So that's one good thing that I do like about this is is how uh, oh there's a tree in my way is how the the field is affected by rain. Uh, it actually does the weather actually does matter, which is really cool. You can see how much I'm slipping right here in this and the uh, the effects I'm slinging slinging taters as we used to call it. It's throwing chunks of mud everywhere. Uh, but yeah, so I, I really want to give this a better shot. I really do. What's up, Jeremy? How's it going, buddy? Hope you guys are doing well. But yeah, I woke up late, and after I woke up, I uh, I decided that I wanted to take a day for myself and and just go kind of play stuff that I I don't know if I can stream, uh, but I didn't want to uh, I didn't want to risk it. So uh, I went over and played on FTGs. Um, FT, FT Farms server 
and I, d I don't I didn't know if I could stream that or not and I didn't want to uh, I didn't want to risk it so I just skipped uh, streaming yesterday I went and did a little playing over there and I just kind of enjoyed myself and uh, hung out for a little while oh animals are hungry I don't have any animals yeah I, do I have animals okay uh, there's a check mark there is that is that a good check mark or a bad check mark? I think it's a bad check mark. Let's looks like out of all those, I don't know why so many of them popped up. It's kind of strange. Uh, how do I set the cruise again? Is it? I don't want that. Let's see where the cruise is at. Cruise control is T. All right. There we go. Oh my goodness, Karain, you're right. How many barns do we have? As long as it don't suck, you got that right. This should be this should be a great server, man. It really should be. Karain coming in with loots number one already, killing it on the day. I mean, just absolutely. Thank you, Karain, for the loots. So there's one thing about this, is it does not like turning with it in the ground. It does not like turning too sharp, so we are really going to have to uh, pay attention to what we're doing here. Let's get this thing backed up here. I know we can skip this, I, I'm aware, uh, but I don't want to. I want to want to see the uphill, downhill, all that kind of stuff. I want to see if that makes a difference. So, Oh, wow. Having some real issues here. Pick that up and see if that see if that had something to do with hanging over the edge of the field there. I don't think it did. Uh, are we in four-wheel drive? Rain locked. Uh, I don't know what this does. Must be up and down. Yeah, that was that was with four-wheel drive. Okay, so. We're moving, but just barely. So we may actually have to let this field dry out, to be quite honest with you. Because it, it looks like I could drive through it, but pulling this thing through it is not going to work. So uh, Let's run a headland and see if that works. Going to give us you can't work this field uh, because we're hanging over in the grass. Okay, so running the headland works. That was uphill right there. So I think uphill in the mud probably didn't didn't agree with us at all. I think that might have been what it was. I think it's. I mean, look at the uphill slope right there. That's pretty steep. I mean, for a muddy field and a tractor trying to pull something through the dirt. So. Yeah, each one of those was a different barn number. That's uh, that's not good. So we're gonna have to go check. I don't know how to feed them. I don't know how to feed the cows yet. I'll uh, we'll have to get to that point. <laughs> I know that's bad, but I don't know how to feed our own animals. But yeah, Bob, either way, we got our uh, swim harder, right? I know, man. It's, we're, we're basically swimming out here in this field. Uh, we got we got our we got our server. Uh, I've already I've already logged into it. I put uh, mods on it. And we're limited on mod space. It's a very limited server. Again, I'm I'm a, I'm a, I'm probably one of the smallest partners they have. Uh, we got a small server, but we have a server. So we're going to have to be very limited on mod choice. Uh, we got the map on there. That was the biggest thing. Lone Oak Farm. We're going to play on it. So, ah, Hey, Kelly. What's going on? How are you today? Sorry I missed you guys yesterday. I really do apologize. It was uh, it was one of those days. I just... Um, I woke up and was, was not in the best of, of spirits. So... We don't want to watch mods anyway. Man, I tell you what. It's been a long time since I've played with base game stuff, honestly. So... Um, 
I think having a few good mods uh, would be great. Uh, I just got to go in and do some tweaking and stuff on it, and I'll probably do that um, Sunday after I get home. I'll be out of town all weekend. And look for some IRL streams on Twitch. I made those some up uh, over the weekend. Because like I said, I don't have a whole lot to do once we get the stage set up. We're setting the stage up tomorrow at 10 a.m. Central Standard Time. So right about now, uh, we'll be we'll be pulling up to start setting the stage up and stuff. So uh, once we get set up, we're done till Saturday night. So, I mean, I'm, I'm, I'm down for an entire day with nothing to do. So uh, eventually, guys, after I get a streaming PC built and get my PC upgraded and all that kind of stuff, uh, I am going to look at getting a streaming laptop uh, or a gaming laptop that I can stream off of. It's going to have to be a monster, but I think I'm going to try that. Uh, that way, when, I'm a, when I am out of town and I have some downtime, I can uh, I can throw like an hour stream in or something. So, Oh, that's not good, Kelly. I'm muted, but you're, li but you're watching. Well... You're going to watch this later and hear me say thank you, Kelly, very much for for being here as always and uh, always being uh, part of this great community, even if you are at work. And congrats on being back to work, by the way. I know I know you're not, I know you don't hear me now, but you will. You'll hear this later. Cuz I know you, I know you'll go back and watch it and listen. I know you will. I don't want anybody to get in trouble with their job now. That'll teach you to take six minutes. No kidding, Bob. <laughs> what was that? Oh, mission complete. Sweet. All right. Uh, I said we'd finish it out, but uh, I think we got enough of that done to where I feel okay with it. So, how do we complete mission? Uh, there are still eight tasks to complete the mission. Finish now. Eight tasks. It says mission complete. Complete mission. Okay, finish now. Whatever. If it means we're getting our own farm, I don't care. <laughs> Uh, congratulations uh, to strike a bargain. Complete. Okay. 60%. Okay, then. Uh, new mission available. Feed them to grow them. Uh, our bulls have be, have to be fed regularly. Take silage. Put it in a fodder mixing wagon. Uh, then we'll feed those hungry mouths. Okay. Uh, looks like we're going to be using um, mixer wagon... Uh, the class 530 front loader and a scoop uh, this is gonna be nice actually this will be kind of different I kind of like this is there AI or GPS I don't know Bob I haven't uh, haven't gotten that far we will definitely find out okay where are we going to Oh, no, hey, what are you doing? Get back in the thing. There we go. Okay, we're following the road here. Told us to go that way. We're going to go straight across. Uh, and we can hire somebody to drive this for us, right? How do we do that? I forgot how. So there's already stuff I've forgotten. Uh, autopilot to next waypoint. Okay, in. We're just going to go in, and then we, me, me and you guys will have a conversation here. We'll just let him drive, and we'll talk our, amongst ourselves here. Um, but yeah, so uh, good good thing, good good deal being partnered with Nitrado. Um, I know it doesn't seem like much, but like Bob said, we're not going to do a whole lot of mods anyway. We're going to play mostly factory game on Lone Oak Farm. Mostly. We're going to have a few good mods, and that'll be about it. Uh, I didn't want a whole lot of mods anyway, so that works out really well. And it's only eight slots, which is fine, because we have a small community anyway. I don't know how many people actually want to play. Uh, I did I did talk to the partnership manager about uh, how many slots and stuff I thought I would need. And I said around ten. I think they offered eight or twelve, so we went with the eight. And uh, I think uh, I think they did me right, honestly. I think they did me good. Uh, again, I'm... I'm 
one of the smallest partners they have. I am going to do some tutorial videos on uh, the uh, web browser and stuff for them and how to get around the uh, uh, the web browser for Farming Simulator. So uh, if you guys see those, those aren't necessarily for you guys, they're just for the channel in general and, uh, and try to help people out, honestly, because there's a lot of people that have trouble using that thing. I know when I first tried to use Nitrato's uh, web browser thing it wasn't uh, it wasn't very intuitive but it did work and I eventually found my way around on it but the biggest problem I had to begin with was um, not getting our server to load properly and I think it might have been just too many mods and stuff on it I'm not sure but uh, either way uh, I'll be doing some of those videos you guys can skip them if you don't want to watch them I understand completely because if you're not going to be messing with it then there's no need for you to really watch them so Those, those will be more for um, an audience searching for uh, an audience searching for the okay attach the front loader where is the front loader let's go see is it in here? No. Is it in this one? No. Okay. Is it in this side? What is this thing? Oh, it's a cat! Awfully dark. There's a dog! Hey, bud! That's kind of cool. A cat over here and a dog. Find our front loader here. Aha! There it is. I knew it was right here somewhere. Give it a good chance again. I am. Yep, absolutely. Uh, I think I might have been quick to judge. So, we're going to try this one more time. I think the last uh, multiplayer most we had might have been four. It was, but this time it's not going to be just for us. It's going to be open uh, to everybody that wants to play with us. So, if we're streaming and somebody wants to join us, they can join us as long as they follow the rules and don't do anything uh, crazy. And if they do, then we will have issues. So what is this? What is this doing? Plot seven. Oh. Okay. I don't know how well I like this uh, control feature they have going on here. I'd, I'd like to just be able to click and, and raise stuff up here because this is this is wonky. Okay. It's all right. We'll go attach the, attach the mixer and see what happens. Mr. 5000. That is awesome, Bob. That is a crazy accomplishment, man. All right, drive close to the solid silo. I need to turn around here. That is a crazy good accomplishment, man. Yeah, Nick, I don't think we spent enough time on it to really make a good judgment, so I thought I would give it another chance here. I don't really know how to make this thing work, so let's go uh, other way. Oh, I dumped half of it out. Okay, let's try that again. Okay, seven. It's a really odd way to do this. So, there's hotkeys instead of uh, just using your mouse. I don't like that.
Do I have to fill this thing up? Apparently I do. Okay, so yeah, I have to fill it up. Uh, seven. Yeah, so that's something I'm not a big fan of there. Is the way this thing operates. Huh. Okay. Like, you don't get to control the, the actual, uh... You don't get to control the actual arm, you just hit 7 and it goes up and down, so... It's kinda odd. I don't know if I like that or not. We're gonna be here a minute. Yes, we are. It's gonna take us a minute or two, but I mean that's kind of the that's kind of the reason we're playing it again, honestly. All right, nine. Oh, nine opens the thing. Okay. Carefully. There we go. Yeah, I don't I don't like having to hit numbers. I'd rather just use my mouse. That would be. Be way more handy. Alright, nine, seven. Looks like we spill just a little bit every time we uh, open and close that thing. Or let it up and down, rather. Oh no, no, no. Don't, don't turn over. Oh no. Go back up, go back up, go back up. Okay. Hit it too soon. <laughs> Why did we oh we dumped we dumped all of it. Dang it all. Okay, let's try this again then. Wow, that was weird. We just kicked straight to the top there. Okay, so at least we know how this part works anyway. I want to get on a fresh farm where I where I have to start from nothing. That's what I want to do. I, I, I mean, I enjoy the tutorial missions here, but I'd like to go start just farming myself. That would be nice. Try some of this from in cab here, see how well this works. One more bucket full. Should do it. Oh, I see. Okay. So uh This will do it too. So you hold the right mouse button and you have a an up and down axis and a uh, axis and a left and right axis. I see now. Okay. That's uh that's odd. Okay. This way, there we go. Dump her on in there. Let's see why I was doing that before now. Okay. Attach, attach the mixer again. All right, let's get back into third person here. Go that way, and then go down. Yeah, so it's like a, it's almost like a joystick feel. You got to kind of move it around a little bit. So you hold the right mouse button, go up and down, you go up and down, you go left and right to go uh, to tilt the bucket I'd prefer uh, they be on separate mouse keys but I mean I guess that works okay activate the mixer drive to the empty barn okay let's drive to the empty barn 
Hey, pup, you better get out of the way, man. Oh, we gotta go this way. I told him to move. Hey, he's trying to bite my tire. You guys see that? Crazy. He was chasing the tractor, trying to bite the tire off. Okay. Open the front panel. Oh, stop at every empty feeding trough. I gotta tell if it's empty. That one's full. This one's not. Okay. That one full. That one's not. Aha, uh -huh. see how that works now. That's such an odd uh, angle to have to look through there. Let's see now, look, it's, it's putting us way out here. I mean, I guess if you do it from in cab, it's. Yeah, in cab is way easier. Boy, what a dummy. Oh, drive to the barn entry. There you go. Yeah, you know, you know how I am with words. It doesn't work properly all the time. All right, uh, new mission available. Feed them to grow them. Sounds good. Done with that one. Uh, new mission available. New mission available. Faster growth, better business. Uh, we received 15 XP. Uh, feed them to grow them. What is this? Today the vehicle trader has a new demonstration model for us. The demand. The damn man. Land cruiser. Okay then. Uh, on this occasion we take care of our plants straight away. Today we'll fast forward to 5.30, 2,000, 9.30 a.m. Okay, let's, let's back out. Let's see what this one is. Faster growth, better crop uh, protection. Oh, this is the same one, is it not? Oh, okay. I guess it's the same one. Maybe not. Yeah, let's accept. Okay. Whatever. I don't know where we're going, but... Your animals, animals are hungry. Of course they are. All right, new mission available. No mission here. Uh, what do I need to do? Let's 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 just follow this thing here. There we go. Go drop the bucket and stuff over here on this side. Can I get can I can I get rid of this too? There we go. Now then. Now we're off and going. Let's hire our driver to go to the next waypoint for us. Gargoyle, what's up man? How's it going? Hope you're doing well, buddy. Read faster than my mind can process. Yes. Uh and no. What's up, Dom? Welcome back, man. Yeah, I don't think my mind processes anything, really. I think it's just here.
So is there an end to the tutorial, or is, it, is that all there is, or can I play, like... Can I free play? I don't know if I can free play. Finally able to get a recording out last night. Nice, man. Yeah, for anybody watching this, guys, if you don't know who Gaming Gargle, Gaming Gargle is, um, if you're here already and you're and you're lurking and you don't know who he is, you ain't got to say a word. Just click on his name and go go check out his channel. Also, if you're watching this later, I'll leave a link in uh, probably right about now up in the top right-hand corner. Um, hopefully, you can still do that. If not, then I feel like an idiot and it'll be down below the stream. Uh, but there'll be a link to his channel there. So, Or maybe both. Look out, car. We're turning. I didn't even know we were turning, but we are. All right, let's take this guy out of auto drive here. Uh, attach the Land Cruiser. Okay, then. All right. Uh, drive to the fertilizer tank. You got it. Jeeves, take us to the fertilizer tank. Game and Garland? Yeah. <laughs> it sounds festive. Oh, I don't do good with words, man. I try. I try, but, you know. Doesn't always work right. Well, the shipping yard. That's kind of neat. All right, get out of here. You're fired, Jeeves. Start. Can I not fill this up? Didn't we have this issue before? Oh, the hose hooked up that time. Okay. Oh, we may maybe we have to be out of it. Did it fill up? The hose is on. Drive to field three. Okay then. Uh, let's go drive to field three. Take off, Jeeves. Words are hard. <laughs> yes, they are. Uh, field three was the one we had so much trouble cultivating, wasn't it? I think it was. All right. Oh man, he waited so late to turn. Thought he was gonna keep going straight. It's not our field, man. You can't be driving through people's fields. That field's got a building in it. All right, so when we, I, I can't really make a judgment on this until we can free farm, right? Until we can start our own map and really just dig in and try to make money and all that kind of stuff. I can't really make a judgment on this. Because right now I'm just going through the tutorial. They're pushing me around, telling me what to do. I've got like seven barns with animals in it. I have no idea how to feed them, so. It's going to be really difficult to make a proper judgment on this until I can actually just, you know. Oh, Top Lips mentioned an announcement coming soon in reply on Steam Forum. Sweet. Uh, you mind copy-pasting that, man? It doesn't matter how long it is. Spam the chat is fine. If you can. I don't know that you can. Uh, but yeah, Bob, the uh, the multiplayer server for Farm Sim uh, will be, like I said, it will be open to people that want to play with us, but it'll still be passworded, and the password is not to be given out unless they're in Discord. Their in-game name has to match their Discord name, all that kind of stuff. Um, we will add people 
uh, I'll make a specific channel and a new role in Discord so that uh, uh, when people will come in and want to play, we'll get them on that role. And if their name doesn't match the the simulator, their their farming name, farming simulator name, uh, then we'll know we need to kick them out. And I'll also give you permissions uh, in the server to be able to do that kind of thing. So, right, just no links. Yeah, what are we, what are we doing? This is not field three, Jeeves. This is not field three at all. You are fired, sir. Not yet, though, when we get there. Yeah, anybody can copy-paste stuff in here. There's no links. And it's not really because of you guys. It's because of trolls. Karain with loots number two for the day. Thank you so much, Karain, for the loots. SB developer 30th of July, so that was uh, two days ago, 1.54 a.m. Uh, Gargoyles time. We're still working on the game. Please expect more news in the upcoming days. But again, thanks a lot for the nice words. Farmer's Dynasty, Bob. This is for Farmer's Dynasty stuff. Uh, thanks a lot. We're still working on the game. Please expect more news in the upcoming days. But again, thanks a lot for the nice words. Huh. Okay then. So you think we'll have some um think we'll have some big news, some big news here pretty soon or Does it want me to go here? Now start at the edge of the field. That's so weird. This thing kinda has a GPS on it, I guess. I need to lower that thing. Is that it? Oh! I don't know what that did, but that was stupid looking. Uh... What does this one do? Hope that's not the one I want either. Old. Yeah, I don't, I don't know how to lower it back down now. Oh, no, no, what are you doing? Stop. We had something going there and you messed us up. Better set the cruise. We'll, we'll end up going way too fast when we don't. So there's no actual texture for this spray on the field. Um, that's going to be really hard to keep up with. Yeah, there's no texture on the field to let you know you've sprayed this. That's kind of strange in my opinion. What's up, Jeff? How's it going, man? You get up to speed, maybe it'll fly. No kidding, man. This thing's, uh, I was trying to. I was trying to get up to speed. It didn't like that at all, either. Fertilize field three. But I don't know that we're doing any good. Like, are we actually doing anything?
Are we all get, always going to get GPS lines here? Because uh, that's pretty nice if we are. Any screens that say what it needs for, uh, not as far as I can tell, but again, when we get past all this tutorial stuff and get into the actual, if, if we can actually free play, then, uh, uh, we'll, we'll get to find out for sure. Uh, I'm just trying to get through all the tutorial stuff and, and really just kind of playing, you know, just to kind of, I want to have something to base a judgment on instead of, uh, that one field three incident with the cultivator. Uh, and it may have been the mud and the uphill, man. It just didn't look muddy. You know, it didn't look like the field that we, we finished up with maize earlier. That, that thing that thing looked dry. Uh, send my weather your way. 52. Dude, send it my way, please. It's actually like 87 here. It's nice. Uh, or 88, whatever it is today. I don't know. I've been outside once today. I went and took the garbage to the road, so... Right, I don't know that we'll have a GPS not in the not in the in the game, you know. What's up, Tractor Man? Is this game out yet? Uh, it is. Uh, it is on Steam in early access right now, so uh, you can get it on Steam uh, in early access version. So uh, it is not full release. And I got to be honest, I'm not real sure about playing this tutorial over and over and over again here. Uh, I don't know that. Um, I haven't watched any videos on this, so I've watched one or two of Arthur Chapman playing it. Uh, and that was just him doing the tutorial stuff. So I don't know if there is a... Um, I don't know what's after the tutorial. That's the reason, one reason I kind of wanted to give it another shot and uh, play it some more and try to get past this tutorial here so that we could uh, we could make a decent, decent judgment on the game itself. Uh, for the gameplay instead of just the individual little instances of tutorials here so but yep it is out it is on Steam uh, in early access mode so yeah it's it's like 80 uh, it's probably not 80 yet uh, it's only supposed to, the high today is 87, so it's probably closer to like 75, 77, 80 right now. Uh, the high is 87, and it's supposed to be over, overcast and raining or, uh, you know, just cloudy or whatever, so uh, not a huge chance of, of rain and storms or anything, more like just some rain periodically probably. But uh, yeah, it's super nice compared to what we've been having, and for going into August with it being cool like this is just amazing. And I say it's cool because 87 degrees is is nice weather. <laughs> That's cool weather for here in August, man. I, I'm I'm shocked, and I dread I dread next week. Uh, I dread next week. It's gonna be awful. I haven't looked at the extended forecast yet, but I'm assuming that the temperature is probably gonna go back up quite a bit. So. Not looking forward to that at all. Still finishing off my Black Rifle coffee this morning. Guys, if you do want coffee, I think the link is down below this, the live streams. It should be anyway. Uh, you can get 20% 20 20 off your first order by using the link down below uh, for Black Rifle coffee. If you guys like coffee and you want to try something different, uh, you can try that out. Had a thunderstorm for the last 10 days. Ungodly heat during the day. Light shows at midnight. Man, that's crazy. Okay, so there is a little bit of a variation. A little bit. If you guys look. you can. Well, you can't tell it from here, though. From right... There was, there was an angle a second ago you could just almost see the difference in the, uh, I mean, it's just a slight tone difference there. Very, very, very minimal on the coloration of the soil. I mean, just very minimal. Just barely see the difference. I can barely see the difference, so. 
Coffee link is there? Okay. Yeah. Good. Good. I thought I'd put it down there. Uh, but it's vet owned and operated, and they employ vets and st stuff like that. So, uh, they do give 10% uh, of all of their uh, all of their orders to some sort of vet uh, charity. So now, what am I doing? Go back to the farm, I guess. Yeah. See, there's a slight variation right there in the color. I mean, just oh so slight variation in color there. You do have to drive a certain speed. You can't just go wide open for this. Uh, let's stop right there and fold this guy up. See if we can tell. You see there's a slight variation in color. I don't know if you guys can tell it. On the right side of the tractor versus the left side of the tractor. It's pretty interesting, actually. I, I thought it would be a bigger... Uh, a noticeable difference, but it's not. It's not really a noticeable difference at all. Jeeves, take us home. I said I was going to fire him, but I'm not going to. He, do, he does okay. High winds, crops getting knocked down. That's not good, man. That's never good. Yeah, I imagine the... Uh, it's going to be blazing there next week, Jeff. I missed that comment earlier. Yeah, man. I, I haven't checked the extended forecast for here, but I'm sure it's going to be hot. All right, coffee is empty. Start on my tea. After my tea, I'm going to start drinking water the rest of the day. Reheating your coffee. <laughs> uh, but yeah, so um, note about Black Rifle Coffee. I don't drink coffee black ever. I've always drink it with cream and sugar, and I've never really been a big coffee drinker. I'll normally just drink it on my, on my long festival days or whatever. Uh, get up the next morning after sleeping two hours and have to do another 18 or 20 hour day again. Um, but I've been drinking coffee in the mornings, drinking two cups, you know, cup, two cups, whatever. And I don't do uh, the coffee rounds. I actually do just the ground coffee or whatever in my old coffee pot. And uh, uh, I've been drinking it with just very, very minimal um, almond milk in it. And that's that's about all I put in it, and it is fantastic. Very minimal. I mean, just a just a a, a drop or two, basically, uh, just to sweeten it up a little bit and and throw a little bit of a creamer in there as well. And almond milk's got sugar in it, so uh, just very minimal uh, creamer, basically. And I've never drank my coffee that way. I've always loaded it down with cream and sugar to just to to be able to bear it. And that's because I've never had decent coffee, I guess. But uh, yeah, I drink I drink this pretty much black. I drink it pretty much black coffee. So, that's uh, pretty good stuff. Where are we going now? Drive to the vehicle trader. Okay. Let's get Jeeves back on the right course. Drink coffee in the heat would give you a headache. Man, I have to have it on some of those festival days just to, just to stay going. There, there have been some days where I'm drinking it at 10 o'clock at night. Uh, if it's available. Just, just to suffer through. <laughs> that's that's basically all you do at that point. You're just suffering through it. But uh, it does get me through. So. So I think, guys, instead of playing uh, Southern Cross Station Day over on Twitch, I think we play a No Man's Sky. And I know it's not everybody's favorite game, but I really want to—I really want to play it some more. Is the coffee really thick? Uh, it is—it it is pretty thick. Yeah, it's pretty—it's—it's—it's—it's it's, it's, it's black coffee. I mean, it is—it's thick coffee. Yeah. But this stuff comes from, they, they get different beans from different countries. So they get some from uh, Colombia, they get some from Brazil, they get, uh, it's just different uh, different coffee beans from different different locations around the world, depending on what kind of roast that you want from them. Big 24 ounce midday, but it's weak. 
Yeah, I, if I drink coffee, I just can't drink thin coffee. I can't do it. I mean, it's got to be it's got to be a good black coffee. Uh, but I typically do like two scoops of coffee grounds for a four ounce cup. So mine is nice and thick coffee. You know, it's not it's not flavored water at that point. Welcome back. Man, he scared me for a minute. Who who in the world painted the line? Look at the who painted the lines and who paved that? Look at that road back there. Attach the land cruiser. Okay. Any specific place or just right here? Right there looks good. Oh look at this. New mission available. Purchase. Uh oh, okay, that's that's all that kind of stuff. Received XP, good deal. Lots of XP. And uh, we'll get rid of that because, well, I, I don't know how to feed the... I don't, I don't know anything about the animals. All right, we got a new mission available. Uh, flavored water. <laughs> yeah, see, I, I just can't... If I'm going to drink coffee, it has to be it has to be thick coffee. I can't drink thin coffee. It's weird. I've been able to keep up with live streams too many work hours and days. I understand that, Jeff. That's completely understandable, man. Uh, again, I am going to try to re rearrange my schedule to try to stream at night some. Um... Once or twice a week, maybe. And when I stream at night, it'll probably be over on Twitch. Uh, but I am going to try to start doing some night streams just to kind of give people that, that work during the day the opportunity to come hang out at night, too. Uh, so if you don't follow me on Twitch for watching this later, go follow me on Twitch so that you can uh, you can keep up with the night streams there. And I am going to have to hit the outhouse real quick, guys. I had too much coffee this morning because I had more than two cups. I had about four cups this morning. I'll be right back. <laughs> you know where drunk workers came from? They're paving, they're, they were on the paving crew. Yes, they were. All right, let's see what our new missions are. Uh, faster growing, better business. I thought we had already accepted this. They're hungry, feed the animals. Like I said, they have to be fed regularly. Oh, okay. The date will fast forward. No, I don't want to do that. Let's check this one first. Uh, feed them growing. Okay. Uh, yeah, so I guess this is what we're doing now. We're going to go back and feed the animals again. So... I'm going to skip time. They didn't want to pave over the anthills. That's what it looks like. Uh, crop mission will be available in the first season between June 1st and July 31st. Uh, physics realism. Arcade. Oh, you can change the physics realism. Okay. I guess we're doing something. I don't. I don't know. I don't understand the whole mission thing. Wait, can I just play? Like, can I just have a farm and play? I don't. I don't know if we're always going to have to do these missions or what. Uh, what is that? Why do we have that thing? Like an ant running around on the ground. Although, oh, did you see, did you see that? Watch this. Back over there. Stronger than I look. Hey, I know what this is. We we use this on farming uh, simulator, kinda. Well, this is the five seventy, but I 
Make a huge pop before we left for the evening. That's awesome. Good for him. Let's let's uh I guess this is ours. I don't really know what we're doing with it, but okay. Oh, attach the vario. Okay. Uh Okay. Put it on the trailer, I guess. Nope, raise it up. Okay. That looks pretty close. Well, that thing actually locked down. We got it on there. Okay, attach the trailer. Got mirrors. We definitely can't look behind us. Whoa, okay then. Drive to field 35. Should we be going and feeding the uh, the animals first? I don't think so. Let's 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 get rid of. Uh, I don't know how to select that. Field thirty five. Actually, I think this has got got us going back to feed the animals. Uh, let's pull over right here for a minute. Let's go feed the animals again. There we go. What's up, Triple Double? How's it going, man? Hope you're doing well today. Adding the dogs to the game 1.0 version. All the code is in the game, just needs a model and a home location. That'd be awesome, man. What's the purpose of the trailer? Because the header is wider than the road is, uh, and the harvester itself is just barely narrow enough to fit on the in the lane here, and with the header on it, it would be taking up both lanes. So it's one of those deals where um, uh, you do it so that you can get down the road with traffic and stuff. So that's that's kind of the purpose behind it. There's a new map in FS17. What is it, uh, Triple? What's the new map? Oh no, that's that the way I want to go. Where's my farm at? How do I see the map? Map. Okay. Uh, yeah, this is the way I want to go. Okay. Never mind. Now, Code has been in the game since a wild animal update. That's interesting. Uh, I wonder why they didn't implement the dogs then. Maybe they had some sort of uh, coding issue or something. Just guessing. Mountain Creamery Farm. I bet that's cool. There's always a new map. There is, but sometimes there are really, really good maps. Sometimes there are really good ones. See 15 XP for what? What do we do? Oh, drive. Okay, we drove five kilometers. Oh, that's not good. Our uh, front end loader thing is in the ground. Hey, we got reverse lights on this rig. There it is. Let's see, where'd this thing go? It's here somewhere. It's downloading view right now. Awesome, man. Well, let me know how it is. Uh, if you're able to and you haven't joined the Discord yet, be sure to join the Discord. Let us know. Activate the mixer. Okay, activated. Drive to the barn entry. I got it right this time. Barn entry. 
Start. Pull up all the stalls. Camera collision needs to be disabled on every game. This is this is just it's ridiculous. <laughs> it's a, it's ridiculous. Make sure we fill these up before we move on. There we go. Oh, I know. I know. You know how I am with words, though. I'm no good at them. So, guys... Uh, good news on Twitch, we now have sub badges. So if you've been sub longer than three months, which some of you have been sub for four, you're going to get a, instead of the little purple and white star next to your name, sorry, the text came up, or a tweet rather. Oh, I'll read that later. Um, Instead of little purple and white sub badges, you're going to get, uh, I'm getting new emotes made and we're going to move our emotes now over to sub badges. So the dirty, the dirty toilet will be, uh, the basic sub badge. The three month will be the, uh, the clean one. And then the six month will be the gold one. And then the one year is as high as we can go as an affiliate. Uh, we can go higher if, uh, if we make partner, but one year will be a diamond toilet. That's kind of the... Alright, let's go back and drive to field. Why is he way out here? Why do you keep moving around, dog? Get out of the, get out of the road, man. Uh, new mission available. Totally worth the trouble. Uh, maize harvest. Fodder for our animals. Okay, so I'm guessing that's, that'd be chaff. <laughs> cough, cough, crane. Uh, there's actually several people... Uh, I don't know if people realize how many subs we had. Uh, until yesterday, we had 11 subs uh, on Twitch, which was amazing. I mean, I was I was shocked. I expected like two or three at the most, uh, and I think we've averaged about 10 since since I've since I've had them since, since I've had the ability to do subs on Twitch. So, which is just crazy to me. That's that's awesome. Uh, feed them to grow them. The mission available. Uh, totally worth the trouble. Okay, so right now we're working on this though. Let's let's. Uh, Let's finish this one up. Let's go back and get our harvester, which is down here, and then we'll drive to field 35. A diamond toilet. Yeah, it sounds kind of pokey. Yes, it does. Uh, it's very pokey. Uh, but yeah, that'll be the one-year sub badge. And uh, uh, Chad Chowder, Chad Cowder over at Chad Chowder, Cowder, Chad Cowder. Uh, uh, his his uh, company is uh, Goblin Graphics. There's a link down below my Twitch stream uh, for him on on Twitter. His Twitter account's down there. But he's the one that's making them all. He does a fantastic job. Uh, he's not doing them for free. But if you guys want any artwork done, you can get him. To, uh, I'm sure he'll take commissions from anybody. So, All right, let's get this puppy on down the road here and get on to field 35. But yeah, you see how wide the header is. It would be, it would be, uh, it would be a nightmare to try to get this thing through town without the trailer. So, <laughs> Jeff, that's funny. <laughs> uh, and at some point guys I'm going to get him to redo the, the D logo that I have on all my stuff the one right there my, my YouTube name as well 
Uh, I'm gonna get him to redo all that. I'm gonna get him to make me a professional banner for my for my YouTube channel, all that kind. Of. I'm gonna I'm gonna get him to do a whole bunch of work for us. Um, but it does cost me money, so I've gotta I've gotta spread it out. And uh, thanks to the patrons, uh, the patron payment every month is what's paying for this stuff. That's the reason I'm getting this stuff done now, is because payments are starting to come in, and uh, it does cost a little bit of money. And the money that I'm getting from patrons is going back into this for for logos and and all that kind of stuff. So. Karain with loot number three. Thank you so much for the loot, Karain. But yeah, I just I want you guys to know that the patrons uh, that I do have are um, are the reason I can get all this this artwork and stuff done. Um, because it does pay out once a month, and that means I can get artwork done quicker. Twitch only pays out every forty five days now, so. Amazon updated their Farmer's Dynasty release to October 31st. It was August 31st yesterday. Hmm. Well, I mean, maybe that's a good thing, though. You know? I mean, it's possible it's a good thing. I'm going to pull the header. Uh, this is our first time getting a harvest, I think, guys. So this is kind of interesting. We'll pull the header right over here. Or the trailer, anyway. There we go. And we will loop around here. Now, has anybody noticed something? The, um... The design of this telling you to get in the proper place is the same as pure farming. Anybody notice that? Oh, look at this thing. Is that got... It's got ridge markers on it. That's kind of neat. Now, is there crop destruction? There is crop destruction. You guys see that? Watch this. There is crop destruction, so if you have to fertilize an already grown field, you're going to need tram lines so that you don't destroy too much of your crops. Uh, nope, let's put that back down. And turn on. Unfold. There we go. Uh, wait for it. <laughs> wait for it, that's funny. Turn on. Okay, T. We don't want to go too fast, so we're going to use the cruise. Fresh field 35. All right. Well, we're off and running here, guys. And there is ridge markers on this. That's kind of neat. I think that's a ridge marker anyway. Uh, I don't think I need ridge markers, though. We'll probably just do it. Just do it. We're going to be here a while, so... Yeah. I had to listen to so many people complain. Dude, I think crop destruction is a good thing. The only reason I didn't use it on my last couple of playthroughs uh, is because I was using course play and I had people going all over the place. So, um, I think it would be a good one to have, honestly. The multiplayer server may be fun to throw on crop destruction. It, it depends on how many mods we can put on it. Because, like I said, we don't have that many uh, megs or gigs for space uh, on our server. So... Markers are cameras to keep you aligned with the edge of the field. They may be cameras to keep you aligned with the edge of the field. I'm not sure. GPS receivers. Probably probably more correct between you and Jeff there, yeah. Cameras or GPS uh, receivers. That that would make more sense, yeah. Let's uh let's look closer look. Closer look here. That's a camera. That's exactly what that is. Or GPS receiver. It's one of the two, so you guys are probably closer to the right than I am. Now, is there a way to enable, like, a straw swath on this? I don't even know what we're harvesting. Uh, looks like barley. Is there a way? Full throttle. Uh, shift. Toggle engine, left indicator, light, indoor light, work lights. Back work light is K. L. 
Um, number six. The round light is not doing anything though. Uh, yeah, I don't see any way for me to turn on uh, any kind of straw swap. So I'm guessing there's not one. Ah, hold up a second. I scroll mouse and it took me back to the uh, the bottom. I mean, the top of the chat there. Oh, we're gonna be here a while. This is a pretty big field. This right here is probably gonna finish off the stream. Honestly, why would you need two receivers? That's a good point. Yeah, it's probably cameras. You're probably right. Yeah, I don't think you'd need to receive. Let's go in cab and see if we can see anything. Not on this screen, we can't. Uh, I feel like... Yeah, I feel like it would be on the class screen right there in front of us. Because uh, that's all our... That's our... Uh, our instrument panel right there. So I'm guessing that screen... The blank screen there should be the cameras, but I don't think they work. That's got to be cameras. It's got to be what it is. Shows you the edge of the crop. Uh, imagine when you get to a certain size header, you have to be able to see the edge of the crop there. Uh, otherwise, you're not going to be efficient in your uh, uh, harvesting of the fruit. So, uh, What is this here? Extend, retract, GPS. Extend or retract GPS. That is sweet. Okay, what does this do? Cycle straw spreader position. Uh, in order to something. Okay. Uh, seems like we broke it. <laughs> Which is pretty normal for us. Need them for the header widths. Oh, you know what? That would be true, yeah. You would need the GPS receivers for the header width for the GPS. Uh, and it looks like we have a GPS here. What does it do, though? I'm not seeing anything change. You guys see anything change? I didn't. What does that do? Toggle wheel chocks, toggle pipe, I'm sure, unload, windshield wiper, steering console rotation, power on and off. Yeah, so this looks like, looks like there's GPS on this. Uh, I just don't know how to use it. But there does appear to be GPS in the game, built in, so. That's pretty neat. So guys, if you weren't here earlier talking about it, uh, I did get partnered by Nitrado. So, uh, we are going to have a Farming Simulator 17 server put up. When Farm Sim 19 comes out, we will definitely be switching to that because they're pushing people for Farm Sim right now. So, uh, we'll be switching over to that. If you guys want to play on the Farm Sim 17 server, uh, let me know in the Discord and we'll get you guys hooked up. Uh, definitely, regulars have first shot at it. And we're not going to be using a whole lot of crazy mods or anything. We'll be using a few, but most of it will be just the stock equipment in game. It's been a while since I played just a vanilla, almost vanilla... Uh, gameplay so but yeah if you guys have any interest in playing uh, I'm gonna set up a channel in discord later today uh, just for that just for the multiplayer and I'll add roles for multiplayer so that I know who's in the server and who's not you would think so yeah yeah I agree Jeff I don't know man it's kind of a strange situation like is it uh Is it worth, is it, I, I don't know, we're going to have to look into that. I want to Google that and see. I want to look into it. Yeah, 
different types of header for different crops. It, it might be. I mean, I, I don't know. At this point, I have no idea, to be quite honest with you. What are they? Oh, that's pretty neat. That's where my mute button is right there. That's my mute button on my, on my stream deck for my microphone. I moved my mic because I moved around. And that's what it brings up when I push it. That's kind of weird. I want to know what hotkey that is now. That's a combination of hotkeys. That's kind of a strange combination of hotkeys. It's weird that anything even pops up on it. Yes, I would like to know how to use the GPS. And we're just about full, too, already. We're only done about 20% of the field. We haven't even done 20% of the field. We've done 20% of the required amount is what we have done. Oh, we're full. I guess. Uh, I'm not real sure what's going on there. Okay, I guess we're full, yeah. So the pipe open. Um, now what do we do? I guess we go find our tractor. Can I just jump in it from here? How do I fast travel to it? I may not be able to. Oh, that's... That was weird. I hate how it puts me in third person view. Uh, let's go. Go across this way. If I'm not mistaken, it's just right over here. So... Yeah, we'll have to go across the river, but it's over here. The bottom green box? Uh, I don't, I don't remember. I'll have to look at it when I get back over there. I'll say this though, the, the crops and stuff don't look terrible. Uh, I know for you guys it's probably somewhat grainy, but just because any kind of grass rendering and stuff is, is always tough on the computer, but... Uh, is this our turn? This is our turn. Okay. I'm gonna follow the road because I don't, I don't know how to, uh, I don't know how to fast travel. I don't know that we have a tipper trailer. Do we even have a tipper trailer? I honestly don't know that we have a tipper trailer to be able to empty this. It's gonna be kind of interesting to see. Why don't we have a sidewalk across this? This is so dangerous. Seriously. Oh, I like the ship, the 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 tugboat in the water down there. That's awesome. Now we got a car coming. We got to walk through the grass. Uh, I wish I knew how to fast travel to stuff. That'd be great. I tried double clicking. It didn't work though. Make sure we're still on the right path here. Yeah, we'll need to turn and go straight this way. Going to cut through. It's like we're playing Farmer's Dynasty all over again. No, not be able to fast travel. Like I'm really going to get killed. Well, I mean, still though. Like, why would you have a bridge in a game that's not uh, didn't have a crosswalk or something across it, or sidewalk really? I would like to think that you could, but, you know, whatever.
Loot's coming in. Karain with Loot's number four. Thank you so much for the Loot's, Karain. Much appreciated. Oh, this tractor is still running. That's not good. We maybe should have turned the tractor off before we left. It's running fuel. Okay, let's go to the farm and see if we have a tipper trailer. I'm sure we do, right? We just about have to have one. We have to buy one. I don't. There's not a whole lot of direction right now. It's it's kind of go harvest this field. Okay. Well, what do I do once it gets full? I mean, seriously, where, where do I put it? There we go. We were stuck in first gear or something. That was weird. Yeah, this is supposed to be the tutorial. It's not very well done, no. Because now, now, well, I mean, the rest of it's been pretty intuitive. Oh, look at that. We have another tractor all of a sudden with a, a grain trailer behind it. Okay, then. Uh, how do we turn the engine off? Toggle gear, activate, uh, okay. Uh, toggle engine, oh, okay. There we go. Oh, I see. This guy has been trying to come follow us for a while now, apparently. Yeah, 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 I'm, I'm moving, I'm moving. I'm guessing this tractor is going to be in the way as well. Yeah, this guy's apparently been trying to follow us for a while. Look at the size of that one. Is that the 900? Let's see if we can see what this is before he takes off. Uh, nope. I was trying to block him up. That didn't work. Cool. All right, so this guy's supposed to be following us. That makes a lot of sense, actually. That makes a lot more sense than what we were about to do. Is this our grain? It is. Okay, so he's going to bring it back to there and dump it. So we don't, we don't need to be in his way there. Uh, let's back under the shed over here, I guess, just to kind of get out of his way. I wish there was a way to fast travel to another tractor. But it doesn't seem like there is. Okay. Uh, I want to go over to this guy. Can I fast travel over there, please? No, I cannot. Can I jump into this one? No, I cannot. I can't even catch a ride. Uh, do you think it might be easier just to drive over there? They don't have two vehicles over there. Uh, I guess we're running, guys. I don't. I don't know how to fast travel over there. So, and I don't want two vehicles over. I have to go back and get it later. We're just gonna run a lot. Dang it. We're running the right way. Yeah. Let's run straight through here. We should be good.
Trying to get me to follow the roads. I'm not following the roads. There is there a fast travel? Next vehicle. Aha, there we go. Let's see where this guy's at. Whoa, what are you doing there, homie? Good thing there's no collision on those. Oh, he's coming straight out here. I feel like he's about to run through the field. Please don't drive through my crops. So this is automated. He's going to come empty the harvester, I guess. Next vehicle, Z, so we can scroll through with Z's. Okay. They are cameras. Okay, cool. Yeah, I, I know the, the debate was pretty heavy there for a minute. I'm glad we figured it out. So. All right, very cool. Now we can jump into this guy and get ready to empty some grain with this button right here, I'm assuming. Is he about to pull right up behind me? Nope. Yep. Yep, he's going to kill some of the crops. Thank you, sir, for de destroying the crops. I appreciate that. For no reason whatsoever. I don't, I don't know what he wants me to do here. He's, he's just driving in circles. Maybe I wasn't supposed to do a headland. Maybe I was supposed to go straight up and down. Uh-huh. Because maybe it's pre-programmed a certain way maybe that's what it is maybe he's supposed to be there and I'm not supposed to, maybe I'm supposed to be here just pull down out of his way and see what he does every time I move he moves so Well, this is getting awkward. Huh. Machine vision based systems. Nice. Maybe on the newer ones, but on the Class 860, they are GPS and look identical. Okay, I don't know what this guy's trying to get me to do here. But I need to offload this grain, so. By retracting the pipe, okay. Maybe that is throwing him off, I guess. Not going to be any crops left. There's not, man. This is crazy. All right. Pipe retracted. Maybe I'm too far forward now. Oh, nope, that's not what I meant to do. Yeah, this AI system in this game is not very smart, is it? Center on the circle with the header or the the pipe or like me actually get in the circle or what? Like I don't. Uh, I feel like I was supposed to go down and back. It started me on this side. I feel like you may be right. Let's center up on the circle here.
Maybe it's supposed to be the other way. Maybe it's supposed to be turned this way. This is it. Nope, he's going back to that circle to drive around. Well, at least now we know where the crop circles come from. Okay, that's on. Hmm. This is getting really odd. I don't like it. The body, okay. <laughs> there are many crops left on this side of the field. Now he's going in a circle again. Okay. This is, uh... I think this is why I didn't buy this game when it first came out. <laughs> this is crazy. Can I Z in a ticket? Uh, I don't know if I can take over or not. Let's see. I can. Somewhat. Whether he actually stays here or not, I don't know. Hey, where are you going? Okay. You came back at just the right time. Yes, you did. This is, uh... This is a mess, is what this is. Leave me alone! Go away! Stop chasing me! What in the world, man? I don't know what to do! I don't know what to do here, guys. <laughs> I'm, just gonna, I'm just gonna run from him. I don't know where else to go. <laughs> oh, come on, man! Leave me alone! Ring around the rosy. No kidding, this is the most extreme Ring Around the Rosie game ever. Turn on the red lights. Oh, okay. Well, let's see if that works. Uh, flash, light, backup, indoor, light, indicator, uh, hazard flasher, indicator light? No, that's left and right. Okay. Uh... Horn? No? I clicked unload. I clicked spill grain. I clicked unload and now he's coming up to me. So you have to tell it that you're ready to unload for him to pull up here. What? <laughs> what? Why would you click the spill grain button until the trailer's under you? That makes no sense. Oh my goodness. Okay, so... When you're ready to unload, you extend the pipe and hit spill grain and then they pull up next to you. But why would you hit spill grain until the trailer is under you? You risk dumping it on the ground, but whatever. We figured it out. We figured it out. I thought about it. I was like, you know what? I'm just going to start spilling grain on the ground. See if he realizes what I'm trying to do here. All right. So that's good. Um, wow, man. Just wow. Okay. Uh, at least we have somebody to, to run grain for us, though. You know, that's a plus, I guess. <sighs> wow, man. That is... That is poor judgment on their part, I think. Yeah, every other game, the grain will actually spill onto the ground. Yeah, that's kind of ridiculous, isn't it? <laughs> wow, man is right. No kidding. And how are you, Sally? By the way, I don't think I've said I don't think I've said hi to you since you've been in here.
the chat's underneath the stream. Um, where the full screen button is, Gargoyle, there's a button next to it that's like a uh, half screen or whatever. Click that and see if it goes back and the chat goes back next to the stream. It should. It should do it. Uh, right next to the full screen button in the bottom right hand corner. You should be able to, to get it there. Yep, not a problem. I do that all the time. I click the wrong one and end up with the chat next to the screen somehow. It's like, I mean, uh, below the stream. It's like, what? Why, why is it down there? <laughs> all right, so we figured out the... Man, that was a mess. I mean, that was just an absolute mess. Well, we figured that out, but that's stupid. Like, that that's... That's the kind of stuff right there that, that is not industry standard, right? Any other farming game, if you hit spill grain, it's going to spill grain onto the ground. Um, why, I'm not sure. Now, I wonder. Let's let's try something. No, that's not what I want to do. Turn the engine back on. Turn all that back on. Let's extend the pipe. And I want to start spilling grain right here. While I am moving. And I want to see if he comes up and starts... Uh, Is he gonna follow me? Do I have to go park over there? I may have to go park over there for him to do it. Find out though. Can I just can I go super speed with this? Am I gonna lose grain? Yeah, I'm losing grain. Driving too fast. Okay. That's what I thought. I was like, eh, I shouldn't be picking up going that fast. There we go. Get back to a regular speed here. Almost 900 subs. I know, man. What are we, one away? I think it was one the last time I looked. Uh, maybe closer to, to two or three at this point. I, I get a few unsub every week and, and a few that sub every week. So uh, right now we're kind of hanging around that 900 mark. So, Karain, thank you so much for that, for the reminder. Absolutely. Don't forget to hit that like button if you're enjoying the stream. It helps me out and it helps the channel out a lot. You guys have no idea how much those, like, those likes help. So... One away, man. That's just astounding, seriously, guys. Like I, I'm humbled. Humbled is the only word I can think of. That's it. I'm just humbled. All right, let's stop spilling grain and uh, let the pipe back in. Since he's not, I, I thought he might follow us around, but I don't think he's going to. I think we have to go park in that little yellow circle every time. Oh, it's kind of frustrating, honestly. I feel like he should, uh, wherever I'm at, he should be able to drive over to us. Whatever. The AI did a good job of leaving the house with the trailer, uh, coming over to here, and uh, and hooking up with us. So uh, I think that's that's a pretty good feature. Like you start harvesting, and then uh, one of your helpers comes and starts unloading. So that's pretty neat. <laughs> you did all the work. We can sit back and enjoy it. I guess that's true. But still, man, you guys, it's because of you guys that I do this. You know, it's because of the community that I do this. Otherwise, I'd still just be playing, and I'd record a video here and there. I really want to re-keybind everything to Farming farming Simulator's keybinds. <laughs> I know that sounds bad, but I like the keybinds for Farming Simulator. They make sense to me. Whoa, what happened there? I double-tapped uh, the cruise button. Okay, so let's... Let's just go cruise again. Hey, wait a minute. What does slot number four do? Oh, okay. No, slot number four tells him to go, I guess. So I hit the hotkey number four. Now let's do this and see if he'll drive over. No. Okay. Number three. No. All right, then. Whatever. What was that? We didn't complete anything. Still got a long way to go on threshing the field. I don't know what that was, guys. I have no clue. Uh, so far... Um... Bob's is negative five. Uh, so far, I would give it a, a five, honestly. 
Uh, because I, I like what they're doing. I just don't like the experience that I'm getting, if that makes any sense. Uh, I like the I like the AI helper. When you jump on a harvester, you've got an AI that you don't have to assign to do anything. It just drives over to help you. But I think when you uh, when you get ready to unload, even if you're only 60% full, you should be able to throw that pipe open and then follow you if they're going to go to that extent to put an AI helper in there, right? Uh, so on certain things, um, the terrain, stuff like that, when it rains, it really messes with the terrain, and that's pretty cool because that's that's, you know... If you go out and try to cultivate a field in mud, it's gonna it's gonna be hard to do. So, um, I think they've done a pretty decent job, honestly. Uh, I give it a five for now. We'll wait and see what full release looks like uh, and more gameplay. But for now, we'll give it a five. Just just based on the on the tutorial and stuff that they had, it's a pretty crappy tutorial. Um, it's not it's not my favorite by any means. Uh, but the gameplay is good. The gameplay is good. Uh, I feel like I feel like everything handles pretty well. I feel like um, uh, there's there's a good variety of things to do with the different animals and stuff. I feel like you've got all the same stuff you can do in Farming Simulator. I just don't I don't like the tutorial so far, and I really want to see what me just loading up the game and starting a fresh farm looks like. You know what I mean? Like I want to see what that looks like. I wonder if we when we fill this thing up again, if it'll move the yellow circle. Maybe it will. <laughs> Too much hype when this game came out. I will never like it, but I do like watching. Do <laughs> I do like watching Deuce fight with it. Thanks, Bob. I appreciate it. <laughs> um, I agree, man. I feel like there was a lot of hype around this game when it first came out, and I watched uh, some videos when it first released, and I was like, okay, I'm not, I'm not gonna like this game. And then I waited and waited and waited, and I was like, okay, it's been long enough. Let's give the game a shot, right? They've had a few updates in. They've gotten some stuff done, and I was like, let's let's just do this, let's try it out, let's give it a shot. So that's kind of where I was at, and I'm glad I did, though. Uh, I would rather, I'd rather give it a chance and give you guys a chance to see somebody that you're familiar with playing the game. Uh, I don't know that you trust my judgment. I wouldn't if I were you guys, but um, I'm glad you guys are getting to see it without spending your money. You know what I mean? Like, I would hate for somebody to have bought this that didn't realize what they were getting into and wasted their money on it when they could only buy one game that week or, or that month or whatever because i mean not everybody can just go buy a new game every day you know and uh luckily i have you guys to support me and that's where these kind of games come from is is i use that kind of, that 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 money that i get from twitch and the money i get from um uh loots and stuff like that uh all go all go uh all go towards something useful to the channel so Make a good decision myself to somebody else else's gameplay. Yeah, absolutely, and that's kind of the thing. Is I was like, I can I can either make a decision on the reviews I'm seeing on it because they're they're pretty they're pretty mixed. Honestly, it's it's a fairly mixed review on the game. Um, and most of the comments I read, even the positive ones, had a lot of a lot of negative stuff in it. But they gave it a thumbs up because of the direction they were headed. And I kind of feel the same way, right? I have a lot of qualms with the game. But I can still go, okay, it's still a five because this, right? Now let's see, I'm full. Oh, there he goes, he's moving. I see him moving. Let's turn this off and let's put the pipe out. Let's see if he comes over here to us. He moved. Does that mean he's coming to us though? Is that Garrett? Is that who that is? Garrett, you coming to hang out with us? Okay, are you coming over here or are you not? Do I have to come back over there? I feel like I'm probably gonna have to go back over there. Let's uh, let's hit four. Oh nope, there he comes! Awesome. I just hate that he's driving through my crops. You're killing my crops, you moron! Why are you driving through the crops? It's Garrett. I thought it might be. Hey Garrett, how's it going, man? Hope you are doing well today, buddy. Welcome to Cattle and Crops, uh, the most headache I've ever had in a farming game. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so that's cool, right? I get ready to stop. I hit four and make him... Uh, so three and four. Three is pause, four is play. Um, so play is him going, running his route. Uh, three is making him pause until I get done. Uh, so no matter where I stop on the... It's getting dark quick in this... Man, it's getting dark quick. All right, uh, so until... Uh, until I get ready for him... 
thought I had back work lights. Where are the back work lights at? Uh, six? Number pad six. I hope this doesn't... Does that mute anything or turn anything off? Am I still streaming? I'm still streaming. Good. Okay. Oh, that's that one. Okay. That's the hazard flasher. That's not right. Oh, there's the hazards. Okay. Uh, number nine. Does that turn anything off? Did I mute something? Did I kill the stream? No? Okay. <laughs> I've got most of my number pads as, uh... Oh, he's going to he's going to unload the grain, guys. He's driving to unload the grain. This is amazing. Okay, cool. Uh, back work light is supposed to be K. That's the side work light, so we can just turn that off, I guess. Uh, let's get rid of this. Keep our lights on on the front and stop unloading. There we go. Check my time scale at the top. Uh, radio unavailable, but I can speed up time. You're right. Let's uh. Turbo. Oh, look at the clouds. Guys, I've never even looked at the clouds. The clouds actually move. There's actually, uh... I'm trying to skip through this, but it's not... It's not letting me... Oh, that's the... That's the radio. That's not what I want. This side. You said top, didn't you? Yeah, I was thinking top right. It's this one that I want. There we go. And we're back. That was quick. So apparently it got cloudy. It rained a little bit, so it's going to be slightly muddy. I don't know where our guy is. Uh, let's look and see where he's... He hasn't made it very far, so the time skip did not affect him in any way. Uh, oh. oh, sorry guys, sorry. I'm, I'm flinging the camera around there. Let's take this off. Uh, the time skip did not affect him at all. So he is going to sell our grain, I guess? We're going to see. Uh, we're going to keep harvesting until uh, we can see our money somewhere, right? Is our money up here somewhere? Uh, I don't see it. That's in the bottom. It's not. Top left. No, I see time. I see weather, XP, missions. The date, oh, euros right there, 71,784 euros. Okay, so if that starts going up, we'll know for sure, but let's turn this guy back on and let's get started back harvesting until he gets back. We do still have uh, quite a ways to go and we're not going to be able to finish it today because I'm about 10 minutes from being done right now. So, But keep a lookout uh, right above the little cloud in the top left corner. That is our euros, that is our money. Uh, 71,784 is what we have now. If he's going to sell that grain, we should see that start climbing here in just a second. And it would be fantastic if it did. Uh, so having, honestly, that, that feature right there, having an AI with a trailer come and empty your harvester and go sell it. And you don't have to do any of that. You can jump in the harvester and just go. Right, being able to turn that feature on and off, I think would be amazing. If this was multiplayer, I think it would be amazing. Uh, there's still a lot of little things I don't like about it, so I'm still giving it a five. But that one feature right there is really neat that they added it in. But there needs to be a way to turn it on and off, I think. 72,769, so our money went up. Our money did increase, and I think it was because he sold the grain. Let's, let's look and see where he's at, see if he's on his way back. No, he is leaving the grain store, though. So, yes, he did sell it. Oh, what happened? Oh, I accidentally closed the hatch. I turned everything off for some reason. Okay. I didn't mean to do that. Yeah, so he is going and selling the grain. We didn't get a whole lot of money for it, but it's probably not worth a whole lot. So, uh, yeah, overall, I still give it a five because of... Uh, I, d I don't know what's ahead. My, my number may change as... Uh, we get through the tutorial. If we get to the point where we can start our own farm from scratch, that would be fantastic. If it's all tutorial stuff like this, I don't know that I'm really going to enjoy it uh, until full release. So, uh, for right now, in in our early access, I'm giving it a five. Period. Until we see full release, that is going to be my that's going to be my judgment on this. So, what is the 2,000 hour thing? Um, I don't know. 
Uh, I really don't know, honestly. I have no idea. Yeah, there's a lot I don't know about this game. <laughs> um, I don't know if that's 16.7 uh, hour 2000. I, I don't know. Like, I have no idea. I don't know if that's the time on the machine or what it is. Oh, well, we can find out real quick. Oh, that's not the time on the machine. This guy's coming back right now, so that's good. By the time he gets back over here, we may be ready for him. Oh, we are to level two. Nice, man. Yeah, good deal. I didn't even notice that. That's awesome. And guys, I am I am going to work on a course play tutorial for everybody that's having trouble with course play for Farming Simulator. Um, it'll just be it'll be Monday before I get to do it, so it'll be like Wednesday before it comes out next week. Uh, again, I am going out of town, leaving in the morning at 7 a.m. Uh, I won't be back until Sunday at some point, unless the driver wants to come back Saturday night, which he might, because all we're doing is going down there to put the stage, and he can sleep and then drive back. So. And just so everybody knows, uh, I promised a special video at 10 patrons. And the patrons, um, once you become a patron, after the first of the month is when you get charged. So uh, I had 10, and then until everybody got charged, one person dropped. So now I only have nine again, so I have to wait. We uh, almost met our goal. <laughs> I have to wait until we get 10 again to do the video. So... Um, when all patrons have been uh, charged at the first of the month and we have 10, I will do the special short video just for the patrons. Just just kind of throw that out there because I know some of the patrons are probably wondering about it. They're going, hey, where's the video at? You know, uh, But just throwing that out there. It's too far to put up the stage and come back. It's, it's not worth it with the fuel and they're paying for our hotel rooms. So there's no reason to, to, to do it and come back. I wish we could, because it goes up at like 10 tomorrow. I'd be back home by tomorrow night, and I'd be home all day Saturday and then go back Sunday and pick it up. But, um, yeah, two seconds, guys. I should have switched over to my live scene sooner, but I didn't. Predator420 has subscribed. Thank you for the subscription. That makes number 900, guys. Predator just made 900 subs on this channel. Thank you so much, Predator. If you're here, I appreciate it. If you're watching one of my other videos and you happen to happen to watch this later, no, you got a shout out, buddy. I appreciate it. Yeah, they're paying for the hotel rooms, and I think uh, we'll have catering and everything too. So, um, you know, I mean, normally we don't pay for any food or hotels or anything. We just go do the show. Uh, so, lucky me. I know I'm. I'm. You're here. Cool, man. Uh. But yeah, I, I, when you're streaming on YouTube, you don't know if somebody's watching your, you know, other videos or whatever, and they sub to you, and they're not—they're not even in the live stream. So, yeah, but I appreciate you subbing and joining the outhouse and making that number 900. I know, man, it's crazy. Number 900—that's—that's that's awesome. This community never ceases to amaze me, honestly. All right, so we're just about full. We'll get one more offload out of this, I think, because I'm about to have to uh, about to have to call it here. I don't like streaming much more than two hours because these videos do stay up, and anybody coming back and watch them to watch them later, it's hard to get 15 minutes out of somebody, much less two hours, unless you're watching the live stream. Uh, I feel like people are more apt to watch longer on live streams because you can watch the live chat, but still, uh, any more than two hours. Uh, looking at my analytics from the streams that are longer than two hours on YouTube It doesn't really do a whole lot of good, which is why I edit down my my twitch streams um, To like 30 minutes is because of that so Karain with loots number six. Thank you so much for the loots Karain Very much appreciated that the the loots have have helped a lot a lot Also, guys, I do have a copy of uh, American Truck Simulator to give away. 
I forgot about that. It's on Humble Bundle, but for those that don't want to spend the money on it, or uh, don't want to, uh, don't have the money to spend on it, I do have a copy of it to give away. I'm going to be trying to set up a giveaway for that next week, so keep keep an eye out for that. Also, we still have this twenty dollars Steam gift card we're going to give away, and since we hit nine hundred subs, I'm probably going to give that away next week as well. So if you guys want to come back and hang out with me next week, we're going to do some giveaways uh, for American Truck Sim and a DLC. I don't know what the DLC is. I forgot. Uh, but it'll be American Truck Sim and the DLC. If you don't have American Truck Sim, this is a good time to get it because the Oregon DLC should be out in the next couple months. And the Oregon DLC is going to be beautiful and fantastic. So, Play Farming Simulator 2017 and always wonder what Catlin Crops was like. Myself as well, Predator. I picked this up last week and, uh, and I'm very happy... Uh, that I did because at least I get to form my own opinion instead of reading reviews and stuff run to the hospital on a cat scan have a great stream Congrats on 900 dudes. Thank you, man. I appreciate it, dude. I hope everything goes well with the cat scan gargoyle Hope everything goes well, buddy uh, And remember gargoyle if you want to play some farm sim with us, we'll have a multiplayer server up in the next couple of weeks so uh, Keep that in mind and, and holler at me on discord man uh, Predator you as well, man. Uh, we're gonna throw up a multiplayer server of farm sim 17. It's gonna be on Lone Oak farm Everybody's wanting to see Lone Oak farm I know there's a lot of people out there playing it right now, and a lot of people have already played through it and done with it, uh, but uh, I haven't really gotten on it yet. So, uh, uh, my buddy FTG, Full Tilt Gaming, uh, on YouTube, has a Lone Oak server up that is just fantastic. It's a multiplayer server. Uh, you do have to join his Discord and all that kind of stuff and get all the information that way. Mine will be the same way. You'll have to join and, and let us know that you're there and all that kind of stuff. So, if you do want to get on some multiplayer with us, it's going to be fairly basic. There's not going to be a whole lot of mods in there. Uh, it's going to be fairly vanilla. There's going to be a couple of mods, and that's going to be about it. It's not going to be a whole lot of stuff. Uh, there'll be no DLC mods, because not everybody has all the DLC. No DLC mods. It'll be stuff you can get off the Mod Hub, or uh, maybe one or two you'll have to get off of a site somewhere. Uh, but I'm going to try to put a list together that you just click if you don't have them, and it should take you to a download form. So, uh, But either way, let's look at this again real quick. So you hit U to dump the grain for some reason and then he pulls up next to you this is all automated I don't know how this worked out uh, all it told me was to go harvest the field so I grabbed the harvester I started harvesting and then we had this guy come uh, unload grain for us and take it and sell it so that's fantastic that's a good feature I really like uh, there's still a lot of things about the game I'm not fond of so like I said still giving it a five until full release uh, until then but uh, yep our multiplayer farm server is thanks to Nitrato we are partnered by Nitrato now. Uh, I finalized all that stuff last night. And uh, big thanks to them uh, for providing us a farming simulator multiplayer server. And like I said, in the next two weeks or so, I'm going to try to get that up and going. And uh, Bob is going to be a huge help on that server, I'm sure, while I'm not around, while I'm out of town, stuff like that, people that want to play on it. Because uh, I will be advertising it, on, advertising it on all of my farming simulator videos, so people will constantly be coming into Discord, hopefully asking to play on it. And, uh, Bob, you got your work cut out for you. <laughs> if I'm not around, it's going to be you, buddy. Um, I got to do something, right? You got you to do some kind of work around here, Bob. Dang, man. Uh, what am I going to play over on Twitch today? I thought about playing some No Man's Sky, but I'm not sure. I may just go back uh, to Farming Simulator. I may play some American Truck Simulator. I'm not sure. I got about an hour to figure it out. Um, but I'll post it up in the Discord when I, when I figure out what I'm going to be doing. And I'll throw it out on Twitter as well. So, I can do it. I know you can, man. I know you can. Uh, and I'm going to appreciate the help, too. <laughs> it's gonna, it'd be hard on me to keep up with the multiplayer server and do all this other stuff, too. So, definitely need the help. And I really appreciate you volunteering to help out there, Bob. What is that? I didn't get the notification pop up. Who was that? Who was that? I saw a patron. It didn't pop up in my, in my notification feed here. Live actions. Let me go to live actions. Yeah, it didn't pop up. It didn't pop up. Who was that? Who became who became a, a patron? I didn't see who that was. I'll look later. I appreciate the new patron, whoever it was. Thank you so very much. That puts us back to 10. You guys are amazing. And uh, uh, there is a setting I think you can, you can choose to pay right away. So I'm going to go try to find that setting on Patreon. That way, once we do hit 10, it's 10. And it's not having to wait till the first of the next month to get 10. So, uh, but you guys are amazing. Thank you so very much. Bob, we'll get together on the multiplayer server. Uh, probably uh, when I get back. It was Ukraine. Oh, my goodness. 
Look at you go. Thank you so much, Karain, for becoming a patron. You're a sub and a patron. I gotta do something special for all the patrons and all the subs. You guys are just amazing. Um, but uh, I'm gonna have to figure that out. Thank you so much for becoming a new patron. And, uh, man, that's just uh, humbling. Very humbling. Thank you so much, Karain. Hashtag Karain, right? Um, but either way, guys, that's gonna do it for this stream. I really hope you guys enjoyed this. Uh, kind of a, a more positive critique of the game instead of me being angry about everything. Um, but keep in mind on Twitch, I am getting some new emotes made. I uh, talked to Raj earlier. He said he was making, he was getting on them. He sent me a rough sketch, and they, it was pretty close to what I had envisioned, so I think me and him are on the same page. He's going to get all of my graphic work from now on. Uh, he did a fantastic job on the emotes over there. And uh, as soon as we get partnered on here and we get to have emotes on YouTube, we're going to have some emotes over here as well. We're going to have them... Uh, they're going to be slightly different from the ones on Twitch, just so we have uh, some separation between the two there. Uh, but either way, I am still working toward partnership on YouTube and keeping the affiliate and working toward partnership on Twitch as well. Game is meh. Yeah, it, it kind of is. But I wanted to give a more positive uh, outlook on the game uh, and positive critiquing instead of just being negative about the whole thing. But uh, either way, guys, I will see you on Twitch in about, uh, about 45 minutes or so. I should be at least have the start screen up. Uh, so that everybody can kind of get in before we get going. Uh, and I may just play some Farming Simulator. You know, I don't know. I, I kind of want to get on field too. It's it's, make it, it's making me want to play. Um, my, my need to play Farming Simulator has, has greatly increased. So, negative five, it will never go up. Hey, man, I don't blame you. Everybody's got their own opinions, and, and that's great. And, and uh, again, I, I still don't hold this in real high regard, but I wanted to have a more positive attitude coming into it instead of... Uh, What's up, Dark? Caught the ending. You did, man. We'll be over on Twitch in about 45 minutes. If you want to come hang out with us, so. Uh, uh, you may, wait, Karain's our newest patron, too, by the way, Dark. So that's awesome. Uh, again, I'm going to have to get everybody together one night. And uh, not just not just the patrons and the subs, but also just the community and do something. We may have community movie night or something. I can do screen sharing on Discord. And we'll get everybody into a call and just everybody that, get, that can make it. We'll just watch a movie or something. I'm not real sure. Uh, we'll have to do something. But community community night's got to happen, guys. Uh, I want to do something for you guys that have given so much to the channel. Uh, but for anybody watching this later, guys, don't forget to like the video, subscribe. Uh, help me get to that 1,000 mark. We are 100 away. We are so close to that 1,000 mark. Help me get to that 1,000 mark, guys, and I will see you all over on Twitch in about 45 minutes. If you're watching this later, get over on, uh, get over on Twitch and follow me there. I stream a little longer there than I do here. Uh, about another hour's worth of gameplay over there. Um, so go hit that up and I'll see you all next time uh, if you don't make it over to Twitch thank you guys so very much for all the support and I will see you on Twitch 45 minutes later everybody